All right, hello and welcome to what should logically be the last part of Silent Hill 3. Now we've got to go all the way back to this. We've got to backtrack all the way back to this fucking section of the game that I've completely forgotten. Where's where's the door out? That's at the end. There's um some room that was a door that was locked, but I can't remember what one it is. Hopefully we would have marked it something sensible on the map, so I'd be able to just look at it and go, it's that one. Well, maybe we didn't, who knows. This is actually one of the few areas in the game where the every when you look at everything, it's so simple that I can just sort of like, I don't need the map for some of this. So I'm not sure how much I've actually got for the final fight. I need to check some of this. I've got four tarot cards. The fifth one should be in that room. Uh, I've got three ampules and that's it. So I can get fucked up three times. Then after that, I'm dead. <laughs> Right, now this is the area where I'm going to get a bit confused. Oh no, no, just straight down here. Oh, where's that room? And there should be some side room. It's like a teaching, some sort of classroom. Okay. <laughs> wow. Wow, they really went out of their way to make this uh, weird looking. There's the door. In we go. I can't remember what's in here. <laughs> Just ran into him until eventually pushed him out of the way. I'm the player character, bitch. You're gonna, you're gonna have to move aside. The name Claudia Roof is wet, written very small on the cover. Looks like this is a diary. Should we really get a look into the inside of the madwoman? November 10th. She didn't die then. She was born. I knew that for a fact. But then, why haven't I found her yet? They were supposed to need her power to rebuild paradise for the happiness of the people. She was supposed to be reborn for that. I'd really like to see her. November 14th. Re read the Book of Praise. I want to thank Father for lending me such an invaluable book. I found what I've been searching for in there. How to awaken God, but it's much too cruel. Will I be able to pull it off when I see her? November 16th. I was free all day, so I read... A modern history of refugees and young slaves' child exploitation. Oh my god. I don't want to be a mere bystander in this world. I can't do anything now. Though that's what it's hard. Alright, whatever. What's this? Birthday card. There's an old birthday card in this desk. So she was still hanging on to this. To little Claudia, happy sixth birthday. I love you as if my real sister is to you. Claudia didn't keep any uh, high-powered weapons in here, did she? Guess not. All right, time to leave. I didn't see this door. Maybe they keep the high weapon, high-powered weapons in here. Holy shit! This is the fucking Silent Hill One classroom. But we can obviously see there's something special about this desk, since it's in the middle of the room. Drop dead. Thief? Go home, drop dead, thief. This used to be Alessa's desk. I mean, this was my desk once upon a time. But you turned out just fine, Heather. High powered weaponry. High powered weaponry.
Did I bypass this the first time around? Yeah, I guess so. Christ. You know what that reminds me of? That reminds me of the fucking first boss from the original Splatterhouse. <laughs> Just something with a bag over its head trying to fucking kill you. Wait, isn't that where it came in? Mm hmm. I think that is where I came in. Where's the fucking exit? Is it... There, it's through there. Look how quickly this room fucking turns into a goddamn psychedelic mess. Oh shit, where's the door? Man, he got me good. Fuck. Man, he only hit me once. Alright. Straight up. It's just this area that I don't know what I'm doing in. The more miscellaneous... Oh, I didn't go the other way, did I? Better go check out that room. It's probably not going to open, but better go check it out anyway. Oh, this is a big room, is it? Oh, fuck. How do I not see this? <laughs> Oh, I can save the game in here. Alright, whatever. Belfry. I do not remember this part. I thought I was almost done. We got all the cards. There's no way out of this room anyway. So, is there any, um... Uh, what was I thinking? A high-powered weaponry in here? Chainsaws. Hand cannons. Bazookas. And, and um, the baby being held. The me that wanted death and disappeared with God 17 years ago. And the me here and now that sought life. This is some fucked up shit. That I don't have time for. Alright. Well, I was kind of... There's just some... Just some random fucking room. It's not like this part of the game is particularly hard. I'm not sure why we have like... There's three save points in the same area. Oh shit, look at that. Visually, this is just a fucking nightmare. I think it's this one. But I'm still on top of my game in terms of remembering where things are. One, two, three, four. Oh, hold on. You got a swipe in at me, which isn't good. Alright, so the end should just be. Oh, there's an X there. Oh, no, that's nothing. Okay. That's fine. There's nothing there. So we just follow this corridor down, turn left. This is Alessa's room. We should save the game again. Even though I saved the game not long ago. Right, this should be it. Time to go. Okay, so I think the god one goes to the top, the moon one goes either to the left or the right. The hanging man's at the bottom. So let's just try activating some of the cards and see which ones we can get right straight away. And they're not in them with the machine guns. Where's, uh, hangman? The full eye of the night found in the Sin Chapel. Hang the man.
I'm probably wrong. But I'm going to put them in there so I can just put them in there. Alright, so let's check the thing out again. Skim, skim, skim. Right. Upside down, man. So that's the hanging man. To his right, to his left, there is no one around. So he stays at the bottom on his own, right? So that's fine. The moon's on the bottom row. The moon is up above, full or crescent, floating high, twinkling light, sits like a crown on the head of a crazy clown. Right, so the fool... So the moon either goes on the right-hand side or the left-hand side. And the fool will have to go below it, right? Okay, let's just skip that. All right. So let's take another look at this. Okay, so there's the fool. Let's put the moon there and the high priestess. Eye of the night. That's not right. Okay, so we'll try it again. We put the high priestess on the left. And then the eye of the night. There we go. All right, in we go. I'm not sure exactly what's happening here. God's will. Go home, Vincent. Home. This church is my home. I built it with my power. The power of money that you view with such scorn. Although, I admit that this atrocious scenery is all yours. If you continue to get in my way, of honor has arrived. Let's get this party started. Heather, go ahead and kill this crazy bitch. This demon who claims to speak for God. The time has come. You can kill her now. You go to hell! Well, she, she stabbed him. You're not going to run? I guess this is the end. No, the beginning. 
As Vincent said, the time has come. Vanessa, I'm saddened that you didn't agree to this on your own. But I thank you for nurturing God with all the hate in your heart. It's time for mankind to be released from the shackles of sin which bind them. But a God born from hatred can never create a perfect paradise. That's good. That's fine. One lesson, my dearest. For the pain that I've caused you, I deserve no mercy. Even if it was to save mankind. father's foolishness. What? You're pathetic.
That was the wrong one. That was the wrong answer. <laughs> yeah, alright, okay, okay. <laughs> You're supposed to take the stupid pill in the, um... Uh, in the locket you had at the start of the game. Oh, don't make me do this again. Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, great. Now I've got to do this again. Please tell me I have all five. Oh, good. Thank God. All right. Let's just do this quick. Right, where do we put the High Priestess? Moon. Eye of the Night. Hanged Man. Right, okay. We're going to skip the cutscenes and just go and take the fucking pill, because I completely forgot about that, which uh, should be fairly obvious since I fucked it up completely. She basically just pukes up a fucking... She pukes up God. eats it, which is kind of fucked up. <laughs> Then we gotta go down there and kick her ass. Right, now 
let's just look around. I'm pretty sure there's some stuff up here you can actually collect. Where did Vincent go? Hmm. I guess there isn't anything here after all. Well, it lets me look at this area, even though there's nothing there. Time to switch to the pistol. I don't know how long it takes to kill this thing, but I don't think it's a particularly difficult fight either way. I don't really have much options. But I have 104 pistol rounds. Uh, the shotgun's not going to be that easy, so we might as well just stick with the pistol. Fucking twice it's caught me. Fuck.
keep waddling around and pushing X. taken a really long time. But we did it. <laughs> That's it. It's really like, it's not that hard. She fucking kicks this supposed holy deity in the head. Just like, ah, fuck it. Yes. <laughs> Man, that was a fucking shit show. That was just kicking the fucking thing in the head. Is that the end? Guess it's time to roll the credits. This is where we go see Douglas. I think that's the end of the game. But we still gotta get the rankings and stuff, so.
I'm gonna skip the credits. Sorry. I don't want to see the ranking because I'm pretty sure I didn't do very good. <sighs> Memory of a lesser kill time. That took forever. God kill time took three minutes. Not bad. Item number 168. Rank reduction. Okay. So I guess the rank was six stars? Eight stars? Okay, so I just want to see. But I still didn't get the heather beam. So I've now played the game three times and I still don't have the heather beam. Yeah, whatever. That's it. That's the last time I'm playing the game. So let's see. I did that in four minutes, four hours, four minutes, 22. Apparently four hours, 22. So if we go up and see the last one. Four hours twenty-three. I shaved a minute off my time. The first one was five hours thirty, so I was just fucking around, apparently. All right. Well, there you go. That was Silent Hill three, and now I'm gonna get back to playing some more Excalibur. So. Pfft.